Ah, the sun, she soon sets. On a lovely day here in Hydranir. What's going on, YouTube? My name is Diesel, and today, we're back. In Hydranir. Hey, I already said it. Said it twice. Ah, we're chilling here in town. About to pick up something from the stow. I want to mess around with the saw. Eh. And it's a magnet. Staff. 950. Okay, so what's it? Okay, a fancy magnet on a staff attracts resources on a large area. In a large area. But I, I don't... I don't need to pick up things in a large area. You know what I'm saying? I just need to pick up a lot of tiny things in one particular area. So, let's go ahead and see what this is about. Magnet on a stick. It's a magnet. It's on a stick. Attracts resources when activated. Actived? Activated? 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 How dare I? It's a magnet. On a stick. Hey, $1,610, $571. We got that. We got that all day. So, what are we going to do today, Diesel? Well, we're going to check out the new plot. I started a uh, new, fresh stat here in the lovely world of Hydraineer. Get back now. Don't tase me, bro. Don't tase me, bro. Don't tase me, bro. There's no NPCs. There's no NPCs. I can't tase anybody. Let's go ahead and put this here. And we got some cash. Eh, I'm going to keep that cash with me. How much money we got over here? Thousand dollars. Whoa, 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 whoa! We got a thousand, thousand hydro coins. We got five hundred and sixty-four hydro coins. It's beautiful. So we're gonna show you the new plot. I did a live stream on Monday. I want to thank everyone for stopping by. It was, we, we hit channel records, my friends. Uh, the most people I've ever had in a live stream is about three hundred and I believe thirty-eight for either scrap mechanic or for farming simulator. What's up? We had five hundred and sixteen yesterday. Or on Monday it was great. It's fantastic. You, I want to try and do something with you too, but we need a bigger plot of land. So what do you say we knock it out and I show you what I've done and show you what we got to move on to. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean, Brian? Oh, also, I want to see what we can make with a uh, with our scrap yard, with all of our scrap metal. I'm not sure. I got like five or six pieces. Someone told me, a little birdie told me that you can smelt them all together and get a giant piece and then make some money. You're not going to make as much cash. I mean, it's all just pieces of scrap from things you've already purchased, so you're not gonna get your full return, no matter how fancy the block is, no matter how shiny, no matter how much we sand it down, you know, weld it, mold it into a statue, it's nothing. But let me show you what isn't nothing. It's totally something. We're up here. We out here living. I'm about to run into the, the wall here. I knew that, I, I knew that was gonna happen. So, this little town is where we've made our millions, you know? Where our fortunes have been forged. Like, literally. Because I, I, I hit it with a hammer. Of course, the sun goes down. But, I was told that I'm in the game somehow, some way. And during the live stream, people were trolling me. And I appreciate it. I really appreciate the trolling. I appreciate it. I really do. But, I am in the game, my friends. And I want to thank Snoopy for hopping in to the Discord. Because behind all of these... Cool. Diesel designs on a golden pickaxe. And of course I, I found it. And, well, well, I didn't find it. Someone told me where it was and I came and I was like, awesome. I got a decorate. We got some pieces. And our mining helmet. We have a golden pickaxe. We have a golden pickaxe. We have a golden chance to mine our way. And with a golden pickaxe, it's a golden day. Suck at other YouTubers. I'm just playing. I'm playing. I gotta I gotta I gotta gloat a little bit. Yeah, it's a little bit. I got a golden pickaxe. Hey, Raptor, you're on a statue. Hold my beer. I'm on a golden pickaxe. Hey, Blitz, you're on the side of a skull. I have a golden pickaxe. Hey, Dre. People only see your name when they're having a bad day. Ha! 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 It's the only way you know where it's at. Is if you accidentally flip your truck. When you're having a bad day, that's when you see Dre's name. But when you have a good day, you can come over here and you can pay homage. Pay homage to the Diesel Designs, the golden, the golden pickaxe. The first million out of Hydrania. That's what's up. So if you ever want to have some high prices, come on over here and show your respects by throwing down a golden nugget, a jewel, a gem, if you will. I don't need shards. I don't need shards. Although, it'd be kind of neat to have this place glowing, you know, in your own personal world. But eh, a little small nugget, a little token of appreciation to the Lord of the Nougats. Taking a little far, huh, Diesel? Taking a little the Lord of the Nougats? Hey, I was not, uh, that, that, I didn't come up with that. Somebody else did. 
Somebody else was like, you're the Lord of the Nougats. And I was like, oh, you know what? I agree. I agree. See here? Boop. Now I know how to turn it off. Thank you so much, commenters, you helpy helpertons. So I'm going to take this down to our plot. We're going to smelt up some gold bars. I'm going to use this saw on a giant gold bar and see what we get out of it. I know we're going to try and see if we can make a necklace out of it. I think I would need to make a necklace with that gem, with this gem, with this gem right here. It's the biggest gem I have. And kind of see and show you the issues I've been having with our new setup in our new crib. Fortunately, I cannot grab my golden pickaxe. Otherwise, I would take it with me and clear out all the lands with it. Oh, the sun's coming back up. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, let's hold on. Let's, let's put you there. Pick you up. Turn you off. Now I know how to turn this on and off. I like it. At first, I was confused. Let's check out this magnet on a stick. So if we get too close to it, it's going to be fine. Nothing too nuts. Nothing's activated. Apparently, there is a switch over here. And then we just grab it, pick it up. It still has the same kind of magnetic, uh, it doesn't stick to the actual, uh, to the actual steak itself. But it definitely has that kind of motion in the ocean. Maybe if the other one, we'll have to mess around with it. I just don't have 960 bucks right now. I can jack to try and do some testing on that, on the other one here. Now does this move, does it move the scrap? It doesn't move the scrap. That's good. Hook. Oh. Oh, it does move the scrap. Great. All right, so we've seen that. <laughs> it's just, it gets very, it gets very time consuming. It's, it's nice when you want to pick up something, like say like little nougats on the ground that you uh, may have missed. There's always our, our clutch quality. Put that, no, 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 no. So I kind of just want to make one, uh, one gold bar, not even just kind of. Because we have the saw here now, so the saw is fantastic if you want to try and make three bars. So say if you have like one 200 nougat bar, and you want to actually just, I don't know, cut it in half. Got a little overzealous. Flying magical wooden box. And you know what, like, you know what, I want to have myself my very own necklace, but I only have one bar. And plus, when you're starting out, it's kind of nice, too, because you don't feel like digging up the whole area. Now, once, now that I've said started out, let's go ahead and check this out. Let's turn everything on while it smelts. So, we started over here in this section, and we could dig in by hand, which, by the way, is still the best method for getting those big nougats. I still get big nougats using my hands. I don't get them using the Goliath. We were on the live stream yesterday, the Goliath drill. It makes holes underneath the, the earth, and we put 100% pressure on it and it gave us little nougats. And I mean like, it gave us four or five big clumps of dirt. And then each one that we jammed in there gave us one tiny little nougat. Someone suggested that it has to do with the fact that maybe I'm up top and not down below. So I went down below during the process. The nougats got a little bit bigger. Nothing too big, nothing too crazy. But of course we are on this first plot of land here. Maybe this area isn't like the richest for the big nougats, even though I am getting Super big nougat. I'm getting super big, bro. You know, you have no idea. So this is actually the deepest part of the section. And what we did, I was trying to make the most compact thing I could. So we had the same kind of setup. We got the one pipe going over to here. We've got four filters rocking down yonder. And we have four of these shard cases going into this machine. Then it curls around. We got another shard, giving it a little extra flushing power and then that connects over to our one conveyor belt that shoots over into the uh, shoots the dirt into our grinder into our harvester and then this splits off it gets uh, goes to another shard twirls around actually goes to a t-joint that goes into the grinder and then this will go into this conveyor belt system which works stupendously problem is is the kind of kind of stuff that we get and and, and great and plus in this area, trying to find shards, oof, trying to trying to mine shards by hand, it's terrible. So I even have this going under this amount of uh, bedrock that I've shoveled and put it right there, and it still gives me little tiny nougats. But all you really need to separate all four of these are just three conveyor belts: one going to gold, one going to iron, and one going to 
the gems and then whatever outputs back here will be shards. I mean, that's what we're doing in theory. I haven't actually used this since I've set it up. Uh, we're gonna have to test it out. Mostly I haven't tested it out because I'm trying to get shards to put in here and it's just a, it's just a mess. So I actually have two shads in here. It doesn't matter. I have had four different shards in this and it still gives me a little tiny nougat, you know? Maybe the pressure just isn't right. Under pressure, dun 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 But I also wanted to try, you know, this is a bummer, I wanted to try and knock this out. But I wanted to make this like super like wide open, bro. So, hey, hey, hey buddy. Hey guy, what's good? What's good there, sword? Hey man, <laughs> see, this is what happens. This is what happens when I'm not trying to find stuff. I just come across it. It always happens. It always happens. When you're looking for things, you never find them. When you're just like going about your random day, like, oh my God, I just found myself a million dollar sword. It's a relic, y'all. I'm gonna like snag this up. Let's go. You got enough machinery? Yes. <laughs> I will rule the kingdom soon enough. Let's go ahead and hop it up. Buttercup. You know, I'm going to put all the relics that I find. I'll put them in there. I'll put them in the cave, but first they have to go with my stuff. I want my golden pickaxe to be a part of the relic system. Yes. In my mind. In my mind. In my mind. I'll just be like, no, I'm part of the relic system. Well, no, it's not really. There's only four platforms. Yeah, but there's like a fifth one over here that really brings it together. It's like, it's like the ring of heart when bringing Captain Planet together. It's a weird pull, but you know what? I'm going for it. Let's go ahead and let's see what this is all about. All right, so I, I basically threw all the gold that I possibly can throw in here. I don't want to saw it up. Well, what? Wow, wow, hey, hey, Oh, that was pretty spiffy. That was smooth. That was a smooth transition. Tran transition? Transi transition. Transition. Say it with me now. Twice. Three times. Go. Nice, okay, 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 okay. So let's see what happens when we get some iron going on here. Maybe, how many times can we split these? How many times can we cut it? All right, so we got this one iron bar, so let's see. Sexy, okay, okay. Now we put these two side by side. Now what? We got two tiny bars, oh my God. Look at that. Now we got two tiny axes, dude. Oh, so good. We just we just doubled our our output. Can we? Can we are, you, are you serious? Let's go. Let's go. Hey. Now of course it's going to be lesser, but I mean it's not even going to be lesser. It's going to be the same price no matter what. If I make two things out of the, two axes out of this, it's I don't really know. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, does the price change since we cut these bars in half? It shouldn't. They're the same amount. Hmm. Not now. Can't do experiments now. We're just trying to get this thing run up and running, get the, as much gold or hydro coins as we can get our hands on here. And then once we get some hydro coins, some more, more hydro coins, then I have to grab all, the, I'm gonna grab all this stuff and we're gonna move it to another area. Preferably the one that I have not gone to yet, the one where there's apparently a lake under the dirt. Good, good, good. Very good, very good indeed. I want a sword out of you. And I'm going to get my sword. Come heck or high water. Heck or high water, you heard me. Nice, all right, so now instead of a ring, we're gonna make a necklace. Let's go ahead and pop you there. We'll pop you there. Feeling good, power pack, and where is my blacksmith hammer, you clowns? So here's another problem. Oh, there it is, right there. Uh, stuff still sinks to the bottom. I'm, I'm digging down there, just digging willy-nilly, and I'm still finding, like, pipes that have gone missing. Cauldrons that have fallen down through the earth. Through the earth. It's wild. I'm like, where, where, where did you go? I found my other blacksmith hammer, too. I was like, where did my blacksmith hammer go? Under the dirt. Boop. Nice. I'm also going to smell these down and see what we can get out of it. I'm not sure, I'm not quite sure. All right, so first things first, let's make a sword. We're gonna make a sword. Drop it like it's hot, cause it is hot. Drop it like it's hot, cause it is hot. Oh my God. <laughs> Whoopsies. And still haven't nailed everything down. Boom. Got our 
sure. Got ourselves a sword. Now for the fun stuff. Got the two little mini bars, like minis. Like mini. Two, two. I'm just gonna heat up all four of them. One. Two. Who? Nice. One. Two. Hold on. There we go. Bang! <laughs> so fantastic. We got some products to go ahead and sell. Let's go ahead and sell them. I feel like I want to go ahead and sell them. Eee. Ah, so good. We found the sword. Oh, that's right. Hold on. There we go. All right. Let's go around here. Crank it up. Oh, hold on. Boop. So I just need to get a couple more pieces of cork. Oh, see? Everything's working the way it needs to work. We got everything's crashing in here. It may be something where I may, may need to get another one of these to combine dirt because the dirt isn't big enough for it to get the big nougats out. And this, this is, this is, it's just not proper, you know? Everything's still kind of missing. It's making them big nougats, you know what I'm saying, brother? But it's getting that gold, kid. And we got over here, we got some gems over here. Beautiful, we got some iron. How about some shads? Do we have any shads over here? Absolutely not. And those shards are gonna be too tiny anyway. And I'm stuck, I'm trapped, I'm trapped. We gotta go around. <laughs> gotta build around this. It's just a little, it's toit. It's toit like a twigger. So yeah, I think it has a little bit to do with the fact that it may need just a bit, bit more dirt. Eh, look at that. I need a filter, and I believe this is gonna be the last charge. You and you are right. It is. It takes six, six charges, or one bag. It's not my bag, man. That is my bag. We're, we're gone, and now it's gone. It's vanished. Ah, good old trusty pickaxe. So yeah, I think we just need to maybe make another machine, or get another machine to bring it over. But it's kind of, it's it's getting real tight in here, kids. It's getting real tight. Let's see if I can crouch. Low bridge, low bridge. So we're getting gold, but those tiny nougats, brother, and the conveyor belt systems are doing b -b -b banging too. So I'm not getting anything stuck on these conveyor belts. Nothing's falling off from the sides. Nothing's nothing's got any of those problems. And of course, we are shooting this against a wall, and it's banging up against that right side. And nothing's falling off that uh, that other edge. So that part's fantastic. That part's great, especially with these little these, these little guys. But I just think we need bigger clumps of dirt, you know what I'm saying? Okie dokie. And of course, everything's down. We'll have to go over to the other ones, but when it comes to them jewelry's baby, them jewelry's brother, them jewelry's baby, especially when you have the golden pickaxe up here, it's gotta be clutch. See that, or I could pull a blitz and just have a bed over here and just stare $5,000. So I'm not really sure how many of those nougats that I threw in there but it was a pretty good clip. I was just kind of throwing stuff in there to throw stuff in there, but it was one gold bar that we split with a saw to make a necklace, and boom, we're making $5,000. Now, it would be significantly less, I have a feeling, that if it was just a ring. You know, I think it would probably be like $2,000, $3,000, but because it's a necklace and we got some good stonk prices, or uh, storefront prices, as some people might say. And that 5,000 gem. The 5,000 gem -roos. Hold on. We have to put a, it's a relic in its proper place. Let's go ahead and turn everything on. Let's wear it. These relics have a new spot. A new spot. Belongs clipping into the rock. No, I'm just playing. Um, you, can we, can we, can, are we, can we sit this up top here? Oh, it looks like Eclipse. Okay, well, that's fine. We shall lay the sword down in front of the diesel designs. The golden pickaxe of doom. The golden pickaxe of doom. And the sword of an ex-king. Soon I shall take over. Soon. Soon. All right, we'll leave that there for the time being. I'm kind of getting ahead of myself. It's fun. It's fun to play characters. It's fun. <laughs> All right, let's go make some bank. I'll, or at least go see if the other stonks are better. They better. 
Okay, we're going a little fast, going a little fast. Watch out for the bridge. Woof. I'm fast and the furious over here. Okay. Eh, well, let's go for the let's go for act number one. I don't even know what the prices look like. Way better. Everything's up. 118. Let's go for it. Get after it. Hashtag get after it. Now those were the tiny bars. Those were the one big bar that I split. Uh, how many times did we split it? So we split once to get two big iron bars, and we split the top one a third time, and then we split it again and it turned into four. Lovely. 118. All right. So one bar, two items. Both items were the same price. And this one was one giant bar that we split into three. What are you going to give me? $1,000. $1,115. And our weapons gave us $1,351. Hydro coins. Hydro coins. Sorry. It's hard to... It's hard to break that dollars and cents kind of thing. 564 from our previous total. And oh yeah. Seven grand, brother. Seven seven grand, brother. Fantastic. Ha. So let me know in the comment section down below. Because I am moving. We're gonna be moving to a different plot. I'm thinking about just taking over the plot that we haven't even gone over to yet. And I think that's where we're gonna knock out. What we gotta knock out. But since I found one relic, I guess I have to find the other three and put them in, a, in the rightful place next to the Diesel Designs Golden Pickaxe. The whole episode on Golden Pickaxe. Yes, why not? When you get when you get entered into a game, it's kind of a kind of a fun thing. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to think of how many different things I was I, I've ever been entered in by a developer. I think it's the first one. Milestones, everybody. Milestones. Sometimes. It's all about the first times. You know? Write that down. Uh, okay, so this is a mess. <laughs> this is an, uh, an utter nightmare. I've dug every single bit of this <laughs> starter area out to the point where I don't want to be here anymore. I think we've made a, uh, made the gold that we gonna make here. Other than just, like, digging with my hands. But if I'm gonna dig with my hands, I'm gonna dig over... In a big area. I want to be in a big area. I want to be a big boy, everybody. In a big area for us to actually use some of these machines because I have a feeling that the area isn't as rich and that's another reason why we're having so many problems. Plus, I need space. I need a little bit more. I need a little more space. I'm trying to make this more compact. I could probably do it. But I want them big nougats. But, folks, that is going to be it for for today. We'll check out the saw. Next thing I'm going to mess, uh, mess around with and see what we can make with these. I don't think we can make anything with these, to be honest with you. I'm not quite sure, but it's going to be an experiment. I like it. I, I keep forgetting I can use these. <laughs> nice, but we use a saw to make some extra weapons to turn one gold bar into two gold bars so we can make a nice necklace for $5,000. Our new setup below is we found a relic and we put it in its proper spot on top of the mountain right next the Diesel Designs Golden Pickaxe. Let me know what you think in the <laughs> comment section down below of the lovely little relic. Our relic. It's ours. Cannonball, take a dip. Boom. But folks, if you enjoyed this video, by all means, hit that like button. Help my channel ever so much more. You know, and if you like it a whole lot, go ahead, hit subscribe. I also forget that there's, a, there's this area over here, but who cares? Who cares? We're going over to another land. Going to another land. New claims. New claims, my friends. Yes, yes, yes. But everyone, peace out, like, shout out, y'all, and I will check you out right here again in Hydraneer. Next time, you should be done. Oh, so done. So done. Ooh.